a note, a strange note, uh, a first for me on this um, beautiful country, <laughs> Romania. Uh, I'm lucky and proud to be living here. And I'm saying that especially after these past few days when uh, uh, at, a, at a peak point, 600,000 people took to the streets to express their support, their uh, love of freedom, democracy, values, ethics, uh, honesty, good government, uh, justice and some more. Creative people, smart, intelligent, involved, uh, funny, uh, wonderful. I mean, I was so proud and moved to tears uh, looking at this. Uh, indeed, in, 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 in Europe, People express their admiration for, for what was going on. I mean, the side of, of events. On the other, we have a bunch of crooks which, uh, or who, uh, try to uh, abolish punishment for corruption if within some limits. And it's not worth even talking about that. That's the the part of the story I'm concerned with now uh, is uh, a thing of beauty is a joy forever, as the poet says, and this was a thing of beauty. And still is, because these people live near here, well not exactly across the fence, but still in this wonderful city and country. Sixty cities uh, had various uh, uh, numbers of, of, of uh, protesters. And it's, I've said it before, I will repeat throughout various notes, why not? Exhilarating. Uh, one rule, suggestion of happiness is uh, realize you're happy. I mean, when you understand, you realize that you're happy, your happiness is greater But just being aware. And as I said, I realized that I am so lucky and I'm grateful. One of the most important rules this time, as stated by Martin Selig, Talbot Shahar, Sunil Bominsky and others, is gratitude. Gratitude for what you have. And I'm grateful for what I've seen I have all around me. It's true, uh, I've been uh, sort of, if not anticipating this, uh, thinking about it. I, I, uh, I've started to hate uh, a pronouncement for a few years now, uh, a, a lamentation which was just, ah, what do you expect? It's, uh, it's here, if it's traffic, what the traffic here is like it is here, we know what you'd expect, this is a country where, uh, which I, I felt strongly is false, uh, especially when we had this tendency of lamenting that the people around, the people living here are inferior to other people. Uh, the opposite is obviously wrong to feel this segregation, this discrimination, racism, but this perverted, reversed racism is also troubling and, and, and wrong. And to say you are worse as a community than others is not, it's not um, uh, following the precepts of, of uh, the six pillars of self-esteem, a classic, Nathaniel Brandon. So um, then again, I used to, when I heard these examples, to say, look, <laughs> I, my daughter is um, a student at the uh, Lycée Francais. And I see often the French way of doing things. And I don't see any reason why I sh 
should feel the many ways are in fear because French words can be terrible. And I will stop at that here because I will get into this sideline and abandon the main theme. Uh, I will just mention not what happens there, but what they have in their elections. Uh, speaking of our protests, our I would venture to say millions of people who love honesty, freedom, justice. Uh, the one who used to be the front runner in the French election race, Fion, uh, turns out to have uh, hired uh, his wife and then his two children, uh, paying them for money uh, from the taxpayers. Uh, and his wife received uh, about 800,000 euros uh, for a job. It is not really sure. In fact, there are signs that she never really performed. So there you go. Uh, but the conclusion, the important uh, message from these days is that this is a a sublime community uh, living around here.